Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Charan. In this video, I will show you in ASP.NET how to bind the enum values into a checkbox list control. And here we got the output of the code. The enum values are binded into this checkbox list control. If you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. For this video tutorial, I have created a new application. Notice in this web form 1.aspx page contains a simple HTML code with some header tags h1, h2, and horizontal line. Now, after the horizontal line, after the horizontal line, I'm adding a checkbox list control. Open toolbox. I'm expanding the standard folder. In the standard folder, there is a checkbox list control. Add that one. Once I add the checkbox list control, after adding the checkbox list control. Now go to view code, right click the mouse, view code. In the code behind, I'm creating an enum, public enum. I'm adding cars, is the enum name, Honda 1, BMW 2, Bench 3, Bukati. And hold on, it's fine. Just for the demo purpose, I have added some values in this enum. Now, let's bind this enum in the page load. If not, page dot is post back array. I'm creating object of the array. Add a list is equals to enum dot get values the enum the get values method takes the enum type so type of in this type of method I am adding the enum name which is cars semicolon after that after that, I'm adding for each loop to bind the cars enum values for each variable, sorry, not variable, cars with the enum name, get cars in array list. After that, now let's bind the enum values into the checkbox list control. The checkbox list ID, which is a checkbox list one dot items dot add new list item, and this like in this list item I am adding get cars dot two string method comma the second parameter the value of the enums int dot int get cars dot two string method semicolon that's it we have binded the enum values into this checkbox list item now let's check the results on the browser google chrome and here we got the output of the code the enum values are binded into this checkbox list control if you want to make the checkbox list direction horizontal, let's add the property in the checkbox list, a repeat direction property, repeat direction is equal to horizontal. Let's check the output again. I'm reloading the browser link again. And notice the checkbox list now in the horizontal direction. That's it.